everybody, it's Marinette and I'm back with another video. <sighs> so much ink today. So much ink today. Okay, so, um, yeah. So, I have received the newest three Sailor inks. This is the one I'm most excited about, but I wanted to try the other two because I was intrigued by them on, um, on the website. And then I also have two inks that I recently got samples of, um, I had actually originally bought a bottle of this, but I did not intend to keep the bottle. It was a gift. And, um, yeah, so, oh, there's water. Okay. Anyway, but I loved it so much, the sample that I got for myself, that I was like, oh, I'm going to get it. So, um, yeah, and then I loved this so much. I love this ink so, so much. Um, yeah, so I got myself a bottle. So this is, like, the last, oh, and then I also have a bottle of... Pilot Shizuku Shinkai. Um, this is for um, experimental purposes, but also my slow uh, collection of the basic like Pilot Shizuku inks. Like I think I want a full set of the 50 ml bottles because I love these bottles and I just yeah. Anyway, so yeah, so this is literally the last of my birthday ink. I also have a uh, pen unboxing to do that will be in a separate video. Um, but yeah, so this is the last of the birthday inks and that I'm aware of, unless there's something floating out there. This is the last of the stuff that I've ordered. Um, but yeah, so awesome. So let's uh, get started. I just filmed my cult pens haul and just transferred the thing over to my computer and it worked and I'm so excited because I'm tired of having technical difficulties. <laughs> Do a bunch of test videos before you start recording actual videos, okay? Um, yeah. So, I'm going to start with... I don't need to make cards for dirty red and shiny black, but I'm going to. Just because um, I want to. Um, I need one on my bottle ring. And I never remember to, like, uh, transfer it over, so... So, yeah. Shiny black. It's a really pretty um, shimmery black. It has like silver shimmer in it. And then dirty red is a maze ball. Actually, I have dirty red in a pen still, so I'm actually gonna. That's what. It's it's almost gone. It's almost gone. Um, so yeah. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do that one first. And I got this from Pen Chalet. Project O four. It's my favorite dark red. I think I still prefer Nimsine um Illus Palace Red, but as like my favorite red red and also Mont Blanc uh, Corn Poppy Red, those are like the top two contenders for like bright red reds, but this this dark red is everything 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 okay so these come this is from the project series that i um got the samples of that i thought i ordered like all the samples of it and it turns out that i didn't actually order all the samples of it i actually did not i missed clear cyan and ornament yellow and i actually have those in a van ness cart so that i'm gonna make that i'm gonna make that purchase from van ness with um some other things i think i don't know what Maybe, I don't know what, because I don't really need anything, but I want those to complete my sample set so I can at least swatch them, because it's only two that I'm missing. <clears throat> the completionist collector in me, like, needs to have them. Okay, so how do I get this out of here? Oh, like this. Ta-da! Ta-da! And then it's just the big 65 mil bottle. I actually kind of prefer that it comes with, like, the, it's the big bottles. It's not, like, I like that they're, like, doing different things to, like, spread it out because, um, like, I don't need two bottles of the same ink. Although, having two bottles, like, with Vortex Motion, I kept one and then I gifted the other one because it was the same. And it was an ink that my friend that I gave it to would like. Um, so, it's, it's good for that purposes, I guess, if you want to give it to a friend to try out. Oh, he ate my my cleaner ink cloth because the other one needs to be washed for sure well they both need to be washed but yeah <clears throat> all 
I love this ink. I love this ink. I love this ink. I love this ink. Spoiler alert, I am in love with this ink. This is my, like, current, it's not my favorite ink, but it's the one I'm, like, the most obsessed with right now. Oh, look at it. Just look at it. Boop, 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 boop. I think I just saw, uh, who was it? I think it was Mystery Arts and Crafts. She just had a video where she did like her like three favorite, I don't know if it was her three favorite pens and three favorite inks or if it was just the combinations that she had together, but um, this was one of her top inks and, and this is one of the inks in one of her pens that she was featuring and it's just, oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay, I will put that away later. Next up, we have Colorver Shiny Black, which is a shimmer ink. Oh, I hope I have time to finish this video. I hear lots of cars outside. And I don't know if it's like my roommate coming home or not. Usually they call when they're on their way, but so there's sil silver shimmer. this in a pen anymore so I'm going to have to got this from Penchelle and this I believe is 001 I'm gonna shake it up again because I don't know how fast the shimmer settles. Oh yeah, it seems like it sh settles pretty fast. I'm not even gonna like wipe this off. We're just gonna get it full. Oh my gosh. see it on the brush. Sparkle, sparkle, sparkle. I can see the shimmer. I don't know if you can see. Oh, I missed like a whole spot. Okay, where, where is... Okay, we can fix this though. We got this. Sometimes I am a genius. Oh, look what it's doing on the paper right there. Oh my gosh. I love this. Oh, I love this so much. I love this so much. <laughs> my inner magpie is so happy right now. Okay. Okay, next up, I'm gonna do this next one because it's not really that exciting. I mean, maybe it's exciting for some people. It's just a Nerushizuku blue. And then we are going to focus on our three new sailors. I originally only was gonna get 252, but then I kept seeing other people having, like using the ink on paper and it just looking really pretty. And so I got it. And actually one of my friends really loves 224. Um, but 280 is the one that I definitely, I was like, Ugh, I don't want that at all. But, um, it looks really interesting when people have played with it. So I was like, okay, fine. Okay, fine. I will get it. Okay. It's pretty. Euro 
Sudoku Blue. this from Japan's it's very pretty blue I didn't get it for the blueness I got it for the uh, experiment I'm gonna do and also like I said oh do I I must have still have bubbles in this Okay, had this small interruption, and now we're back. We're gonna, I just finished the, the swatch for Shinkai, and put that back. Um, and then we're gonna go on to our Sailor inks. Oh, I'm so excited to try these. I also have um, some Tomoe River paper. I have 52 and 68. I don't know if it makes a difference. And then I have a piece of Maramon uh, from the little notebook that I use for 30 inks. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna start with two, fifty. 224. I'm going to save 252 for last because that's the one I'm most excited about. So 224 is one of these like, I think it's one of these like grainy purple ones. Okay, where is my dip pen? I am surrounded by so much crap right now. I feel like that's like my permanent state at this desk. It's either work or ink. So it looks like in the cap. And I got these from Pentrelle. Two, four. That's really pretty. I don't think it matters between the, the weights of the of the paper, um, but I have okay. So I have. I'm gonna write this on here. I have. Okay, this is 68. This is 52, and then that's just the matter one. I'm going to paint a little swatch across them to see what happens. Because it's supposed to show the, like the dual shading better on the Tomoe River paper. Oh god, I didn't want to do that. Okay. Actually, chromatography would be interesting, but I don't know where my strips are at the moment. So we will have to save that for another day. Okay, next up we have Sailor Inks number 280. And I'm going to do this. Two eighty is like the this one. It's this one. <laughs> it's like green, is it yellow? I don't really know. like and then this is 252 which is like that that's pretty I like that a lot
I love okay so that pen baby s 401 that I tried that ended up not being like a pinky gray this is what I thought that was going to look like so this is what it didn't look like but I think I love this okay so now I have to move these without murdering them oh, I think I murdered them okay come here okay all right so we're Okay, I was going to save this one for last, but this is the one I have open with the brush, so we're just going to go ahead and do it. It goes in numerical order anyway, so I think that's good. I'm going to... No. So pretty. <laughs> okay, and last but not least, we have. Did I grab too many cards or am I missing one? No, one, two. One, two, three. Okay, yeah, okay, never mind. The front or the back? Ooh, that's so, it's like pink and like green, but it's kind of gray and dusty. Oh, I love it. Okay. So let me know what you think of the video, because now that I'm recording on my new phone, like, does it look any different to you? Um, like, it doesn't matter, because this is my phone now. And that's what I used to record, so that's what we've got to work with, but Sailor Ink Studio number 280. There we go. Those are the three new sailor inks. <sighs> Two fifty two is still my favorite, but I'm glad I have all of them. So here's what they look like on the Maraman Nemusine Nim paper. The swatch of two five two is way too much, and it's still drying. But you do see a lot. I think you see more of the shading. And the, um, or the dual shading aspects. Oh my gosh, this one's never going to dry. And then that's the 52 gram, and then this is the 68 gram. Yeah, you can see, totally see, like, how, what's all going on in here. But then that's what they look like on coloring cards. Obviously, this one, these two are still kind of drying, but... Oh, that's so fun! I wonder what they look like in pens. Pearl, what are you doing? There's an empty grocery bag. She must get in it. That is what she's doing. Okay, so I'm going to close this up before I break my dip pen. Yeah, so I'm not having like an hour and a half long video, but I'm going to be posting like 8 million videos. I should probably just like schedule these, but I'm really excited and I don't want you all to see them as soon as you can see them, so... Plus 30 inks is coming, so it's gonna be a whole lot of 30 inks. So you're just gonna you're just gonna be inundated with me if you decide to stay around and watch all of that. <laughs> and if you do, thank you so much. So awesome. 
cool. I have one more unboxing to do. I'm going to do in a different video. It's a pen. I talked about it in my pen video. Um, but yeah, so cool. Awesome. So I will see you soon. Um, these still need to dry, so I'm just going to let them dry and, um, maybe help that along by moving it around. Um, yeah. And we'll, um, we'll talk about these later. Oh, well, here, let me go ahead. And here is Ooh, ooh, okay. Pilot Roshizuka Shinkai. I wonder, this is the one I think I had um, soap in my brush still. So I wonder if that, I wonder if it looks like this or if it's just because I had the soap in the brush. And then Color Brush Dirty Red, the best dark red in all of existence in my personal humble opinion. Um, and then we have Shiny Black, which is still drying, but is shiny and black. Ah, that's so pretty. <laughs> Look like at it in the writing. I love it. I love it. Okay, cool. Awesome. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you soon with another video. Take care. Love you. Bye.